The Coalition for Good Governance and Community Development has applauded the Police Service Commission under the leadership of Solomon Arase for demonstrating unwavering commitment to transparency and excellence in its activities. The Coalition says the Commission's dedication to upholding the highest standards of integrity, professionalism and inclusivity has resulted in recruitment processes which truly represent Nigeria's diverse talent pool. Speaking at a press conference on Tuesday in Abuja, the convener of the coalition, Umwogo Indubisi, says these efforts have not only bolstered the Nigeria police force, but also instilled hope and confidence in the citizens. The Coalition for Good Governance and Community Development, therefore, wants to challenge Mr. Arasi to scale up his current achievement. We have consequently identified the following as, as areas he should lead the Nigerian Police Service Commission to explore to improve policing in Nigeria. The Commission should assess the necessary funding and collaboration to boost intelligent gathering and sharing, enhancing the framework for more effective and pro profi proficient intelligent and gathering and sharing is crucial. This includes building interagency collaboration and improving the utilization of intelligence for active policing. We recognize that funding challenges are real, but appeal to Mr. Arase to lobby the federal government to invest more in technology and communication. Our plea, this, our plea in this regard is from the recognition that leveraging technology can greatly improve the efficiency and effectiveness of the police force. This includes using modern equipment and digital tools for communication, data collection, and analysis. The Commission should also sustain its officers' training and education with regular training and education programs for officers, would, adhere, would enhance their skills and expertise, making them better equipped to handle modern policing challenges. Mr. Arase should further help the Commission by vote to pursue more funding, which is essential for the overall safety of police officers.